Today we are 129 days to the next general elections. Elections produce winners, elections produce losers. In fact, in any election, there are more losers than winners. But it is wrong when we see people using desperate youth whose only crime, quote-unquote, is the fact that they have no steady jobs to do what we saw in Wasingishu. I think what happened in Wasingishu yesterday, and I'm glad the leader of One Kenya Alliance has condemned it, the governor of Wasingishu has condemned it, what happened in Wasingishu must be condemned by all peace-loving Kenyans. If we are to compete let us compete on our ideas and programs for the people we want to serve. Ruto should be free to campaign in Nyanza as much as the Right Honorable Raila Odinga should be free to campaign in any part of this country. But it's not just at the national level. It's very sad to me. I've been a politician for 19 years. And I can tell you one of the things that I've never done is to give a young boy or a young girl money to go and buy alcohol to go and disrupt another politician's program. I don't do it. I want to tell our young people that anybody who gives you alcohol, anybody who gives you stones to go and throw at an opponent does not care about you. Those who care about our youth should empower them through education, and giving them opportunities to get meaningful jobs, but not to give them stones to go and throw and destroy the opponent's rally. I say this because I and myself have been a victim. Right now I'm moving around wanting to be governor here, and God willing, and the people of Sia willing, I will be governor on the 10th of August this year. But twice, Twice in my opponent's area, drunken youth have been given money to shout, to heckle me, and yet the same opponent, when he came to my brother's burial, I personally made sure that he spoke for two hours without anybody saying anything. This is how we should conduct our policy. If you are here and you support Senator James Orengo, tell him that I want the two of us to compete on ideas. I want the two of us to compete on our programs. What we have done for the people of Siaya and what we intend to do for the people of Siaya. Please go tell him that he's free to come to my home to campaign in front of my wife, Susan Adiambo. She will not give him the vote. She will not give him the vote, but she will not hire youth to heckle him. Because what he's doing is wrong. On Friday, I was heckled in Ugunja. Two weeks ago, I was heckled in Ugenya. He comes here, I don't pay anybody because I don't believe in that. You only pay people to heckle one another if you know you have no record and you have no intention of serving the people. I'm very proud, those of you who do not know, Rayeda was founded in 1988. I'm the only person who has been elected twice. And 
and I hold that record proudly and it will never change for a long time because I knew that the reason why I was elected was to serve the great people of Rarika just like the reason why I want to be governor Siaya is to serve the great people of Siaya. I put my personal interest behind to serve my people. This is what should be about leadership. But we have seen the lies that is going on. Yesterday we know what happened in Nairobi. Raila Odinga is not going to be a candidate for ODM. Raila Odinga is going to be a candidate for Azimio One Kenya Alliance. Anybody telling you to vote six piece, ask him why he's excluding Raila Odinga. He's too big for ODM. But they will tell you six piece because they have done nothing and suddenly they realize it is 120 days to elections and they want to hang on to the court. Akwaya Ujo Dalawa. Raila Odinga Okvibedo candidate Mar ODM. Raila Odinga Dibedo candidate Mar Azimio One Kenya Alliance. Ngata ngata mabiro kakoni ni modi goch the ODM six piece. Owoni. Nikecho ngeyo. Niki moseti mo onge. Korodu wama kokod Raila. Wano yudu mare. Nukata Raila Orem. Nuki okobane. Emo miyawachu ni nikata ngumbo. Okane ODM. Kani a party meaning the United Democratic Movement. My member of Azimio, I have had my opponents try to associate me with the One Kenya Alliance. I am in United Democratic Movement, and it is not only in Azimio, but their NDC was attended by the Right Honorable Raila Odinga and my competitor James Orengo. So UDM is a member of Azimio and I know I will win on my product. Who win your area? Who may you go to Jati? Kosoka Jati? The first 10 years of devolution was experimental. The next phase of devolution, we must make empower our people. Right now, Nyetina Nyoti Muklasaboru. Anokan, I am not an MP or anything at the moment. Already, asen wa mokwayo alufachien. Magnitino matiandre, mabruduaro no konyi di school fees. We should be talking about how we can give meaningful jobs to our uh, young children. We should be talking about how we can put food on the table. We should be talking about education for our children. We should be talking about clean water for our people and medical facilities and good roads and how to enhance the power of cooperatives so that our people can have money in their pockets. Wawe wondo ji, ni wacho neji ni six piece. My friend, kisebe do kiti mono ono, tarika chiku dumara pa, ibro chwadi proper, ikura.